With more pharmacies offering the new COVID boosters, people have questions about the vaccines, including whether they cause any type of side effects. CBS 17's Maggie Newland is live for us tonight in Raleigh, getting some answers about that. Maggie. Rod and Angela, before you head to the pharmacy for your COVID shot, you probably wonder, might you have any side effects or should you plan a day off of work? Well, I took that question to pharmacists and infectious disease experts. Okay, all right, we're ready. One, two, and three. And we are all set. Tiffany Edwards stopped by We Care Pharmacy in Apex for her COVID booster. It had no hesitations about getting my shot. Pharmacist Amrish Patel says he's seen a pretty high demand for the vaccines since the bivalent booster came out. A lot of people coming in. We're doing probably averagely about 30 to 40 to 50 a day. He currently has the Pfizer vaccine, and despite giving all those shots, he says he hasn't heard any complaints about side effects. We've been doing it for about good 10 to 12 days now and haven't had a single person call me for anything yet. I mean, basically, people are used to now. He says that's a big change from when the first COVID vaccines came out, and he took lots of calls about side effects. He's not sure whether they really are less pronounced with this booster or whether people are just expecting them. Well, as we saw before, some people are more impacted than others by the vaccine. Dr. Pia McDonald, an infectious disease expert with RTI International, says she expects side effects to be similar to other boosters. Although the new boosters help your body fight two different variants of the coronavirus, the total dose is the same as previous boosters. Half of it is the old version and half of it is the new version. The ingredients are all the same minus the addition of that new mRNA piece that protects against BA4 and 5. Tiffany hasn't had side effects with her other COVID shots. I have had nothing of significance. I've been really, really fortunate. And she decided to get her flu shot as well. So majority of the people are getting both shots at the same time. Now I checked with two additional pharmacists. Both told me they hadn't heard anyone talking about very severe side effects. One said he had heard several people having sore arms, but of course it's important to remember, again, everyone does react to the shot a little bit differently. We're live in Raleigh, Maggie Newland, CBS 17 News. Yeah, pretty common to get a sore arm with pretty yeah. much any shot you get. So Maggie, thank you.